Hey guys, so today you and I are going to talk about the IT industry and the pandemic. So let's get into it. So the question in question was, Frederick, can you talk a little bit about how you think that the IT industry is going to change after the pandemic? And the short answer is, I don't think it's going to change all that much. I think that the one thing that will change is that we will adopt a new perspective on remote work. So let me explain that a little bit. Basically what I'm stating here is isn't that I think that it's going to become very normal for people to be, uh, be remote freelancers. But what I do believe is that people have, for better or for worse, been introduced to the fact that this traditional notion that you need to gather everybody in an office and they always need to be in that office so that you can keep everything working and you as a manager can make sure that everybody's doing what they're supposed to be doing is a little bit overplayed because the reality is actually that if you have good people most people will actually f if you just leave them alone they will still do what they're expected to do because they have a sensation of loyalty and work ethics most people do have that if they care about what they do in some fashion and you treat them well and I think that the this idea that some companies has ha, have had because it has been the norm for the longest time that you should go to your office and you should do all of these things it's in some companies it's much more common but in IT it I mean the idea of remote workers has been a thing I don't think uh, that's going to change all that much but I think that it's going to be more acceptable I think more companies are going to come around to the fact that well it's not really a big deal if John and Jane like yeah they come in three days a week or like the, maybe they come in every other week or something like that as long as we have them on you know connected through some video conference thing or whatever it's kind of all good right <clears throat> that I would say it's a little bit of a looser let's call it that a looser um, uh, work environment where you can pretty much work from home if you wanted to I don't think that it's gonna change all that much uh, in in other areas because fundamentally the like this is how it always goes with the economy it goes up and then it goes down for various reasons so it's usually it's gonna I mean it's gonna take some time but it's gonna recover and most things are gonna go back to the way they have been doing and this sort of thing has really like the only fundamental change to our uh, to our work process as software developers uh, within IT is practically that okay we can't be in the office as much but hey we're still here and it still seems to be working and people have found a way around this issue which I mean this this thing isn't new it has been here forever and it has been working for a, quite a lot of companies for the longest time I just think that now more companies will be aware of that hey it's actually fine to not have everybody in the office all the time maybe it's even gonna give a little sm a small boost to having remote workers even in other countries and so forth. That's a little bit farther than I want to uh, th theorize, but at the very least I think that it's going to have a, an impact on the way that we view office culture. So what I want you to take away from this is just that, at least from my perspective when it comes to the pandemic, it's at some point going to end, I, I hope. Uh, when, I don't, of course, nobody really knows, but at the very least I think that this this whole ordeal has shown that remote work is something that is feasible and it's not it's not the end of the world pun no pun intended but it is like having people not come into the office is actually something that it it's got it, it, it does work because fundamentally this assumption that people only do what they're supposed to be doing if you crack the whip over them is it's a flawed idea it's it's simply not true most people who are dedicated to something and are good people and feel some measure of work ethics will actually do what they are expected to even if they're working from home and this has been proven by many companies for the longest time it's just not been the norm and I believe that the acceptance of remote workers is going to go up just in general that's what I believe at least have a great day